This is a frugal gardener. I um, had not intended on making a video today. This bucket that you're looking at is basically a trash can. I think I paid like five bucks for it. I grew potatoes in this bucket and I'm not sure if you remember the earlier video but I decided to do something different this year. I added straw and um, the straw went inside well with in between the dirt and um, then I added more on the top the straw on the inside was a great idea the straw on top not so much so stick with me and I'll show you what happened and I'll show you why I decided to do this video welcome back to the frugal gardeners garden what you're looking at here is my container number two this was an old Gatorade bucket given to me by a neighbor I've been using it to grow white potatoes this is the first bucket that I emptied I did not expect to get anything out of this because when I put the straw on top I didn't anticipate that I wasn't going to be able to judge when I needed to water this and when I did need to water it so throughout the summer I overwatered, I underwatered and finally took the straw off when my flower, my plant started dying. So I replanted and got new plants towards the end of the summer. And I decided, eh, it's now November. Let me just dig this up so I can repurpose the soil or maybe just let it rest for over the winter. And surprise, surprise, I got quite a few potatoes. I really did not expect to get anything. Now the reason why there's such a discrepancy is because the smaller ones were on the top. That was what I, from my second planting, and the larger ones were the ones that I originally planted. These are Yukon Golds. And now, I mean I'm really happy with what I have here because as I mentioned I wasn't expecting to get anything. So, I decided I'm going to go ahead and dump this guy and see how this one fared. So let me get started. I am about halfway down the bucket, almost halfway down, and so far all I've gotten is these little guys here. I used to be disappointed when I got small potatoes like this until I realized that I could replant these in the spring and grow more potatoes so I'm kind of happy to have these. So what I've decided to do because I see a few potatoes down here I don't know what I have yet I don't want to bruise them I don't want to bust them up so I'm going to dump them onto this plastic which is the way I normally do it and this way I can see what I have and it will take me a lot less time. So looks like we have another successful haul this is the same pretty much the same as the first one where you'll see the smaller ones from the latter planting and you'll see the larger ones from the first planting and um, not sure why some are darker than the others but this is nice I'm happy with this especially when you combine this with these over here so all together I'm not sure if I weighed this up what it would come out to but they're a pretty decent haul for just having two buckets all those potatoes came out of this uh, these two buckets here so I'm gonna put these together and see what I have so this is it this is the haul from both containers not bad at all we will have potatoes now for uh, Christmas and New Year's and um, we have a nice haul of uh, potatoes for the holidays this is the frugal gardener I really appreciate you guys spending part of your day with me I hope that you subscribe I hope you tell your friends leave the comments below and remember, when you grow your own food, 
You will always know where it comes from. You guys have a great day. Catch you later.